Hey guys, it's extra bright and I just dropped some stuff off to Goodwill. Food vlogging coffee, just real quick. I look horrible. I don't know what's going on. I'm like itchy, sneezy, coffee, and uh, coffee, not like coffee, like uh, uh, coffee. <coughs> Excuse me. And um, I've, I'm breaking out, so you know, there's all that, it's good. <laughs> Not really, but whatever. I have a job today, which would make so much sense because, like, I book a job every month or two, and so whatever. But I have a job today. I'm going to be face painting. This is actually um, my nephew's mother. It's her nephew. I don't know if that makes sense. It's family in a really roundabout, odd way that, you know, we all have family nowadays. Um, so... I actually love this family. It's uh, my nephew's mom, her brother, his name is Joe. He's awesome, I love him. He's like my straight boy crush, like, I love him. Uh, he's got, he's married, and I think his wife is adorable and sweet, and they have two babies now. And uh, I'm painting faces, I think for the oldest one's birthday. So, that's fun. Anyway, um, I am, Working on getting some foods cooked for the week and everything else today. It's been just long and ridiculous. And I'm tired. I'm so tired. And I slept a lot. I just don't know. Like something's going on. But anyway, um, so that was the beginning of my food vlog. And I will be keeping up with you guys throughout the day. guys okay so I went and I did my party I um, face painted it was kind of cool because it wound up only being an hour not cool because I gave her a discount because generally I'm like you book me for two hours that's a minimum but it was kind of family so I'm like that's cool I'm just lucky that you booked me for real I feel very grateful every time I get to paint a party I'm so grateful because it's the coolest funnest thing and the kids are so excited even if it doesn't even come out good which trust sometimes it does not come out good you got people asking all kinds of weird stuff and kids are bopping around so it can look pretty horrific sometimes <laughs> but the kids are always happy and I live in a kind of small area and I've been painting for the same people so a lot of the kids are so excited when they see me because they know me they'll see me out or they'll see me at different places or at the different parties and they're like do you remember me you painted me two years ago I'm like yes I remember you I remember them all they're fantastic so that's always fun um, you saw I had coffee for breakfast I had a chia seed and strawberry chia seed, strawberry, and um, mint tea smoothie for lunch. It was delicious. And I'm about to eat dinner. This is um, rice, black beans, and enchilada sauce. And um, I'm doing pretty good with my goals of like taking photos for everybody and cooking for everybody. It's been a good day so far. I'll keep going, right? Just one step one foot in front of the other foot I feel like I might I might be climbing back on the wagon I might be like on the wheel like climbing up onto it how exciting okay so today I I kept a book I'm gonna show it to you that's my book and I basically figured the cost of every meal and how it broke down okay so today I have I should have done a total total but I didn't do a total total anyway hold on okay if you look at the foods that were consumed that I made and that were consumed today I have a total um $15.76 being used today. Uh, that is including snacks and drink like tea because hot tea is 12 cents a bag. Um, so 
that includes like every aspect and I the only thing it doesn't include is that I also cooked my wife's lunches for the next week so that is um, that is well actually it was eight servings I made it today and it was eight servings and it the total for the entire thing was seven dollars and sixty eight cents and it broke down to be 96 cents per serving or per meal um, so I, I didn't count that because it wasn't consumed today just just putting it out there I did count the 96 cents worth of the meal that she had today that came out of that but that's it anyway so fifteen dollars and seventy six cents and the original article that I read was about um, a woman who was talking about feeding her kids or her family on um, less than twenty dollars I think it came out to be nineteen dollars a day I don't know I can do that math for you really quickly because I'm super fast at calculators um, okay she talked about having five hundred dollars worth of food assistance being the majority of where they get the food. So it's actually $16 and 66 cents a day. However, there's a cat that just jumped up here. It's a poppy. Come here, pop. Come here, come on. However, her kids went to school. Now, when she was talking about not being able to feed them, they were like, we eat breakfast and lunch at school. We eat breakfast if we get there early enough, which, Oh, that's a tail. There's a poppy. Poppy. Um, let's see. Oh, hello. They were like, we eat breakfast if we get there early enough, which I, I was like, no. If you're if you don't have enough food to feed your kids, you bring them to school on time to get their breakfast. Pop, get down. Um, and that's not trying to be ugly. I'm just saying like you find a way because they need to eat. Um. So, and then they said that half the time the lunch, the school lunch wasn't worth eating, so they just don't, which didn't really make a lot of sense to me either, but I understand, I guess. I don't know. I used to love school lunch, but that, I don't know, that's a long story. Uh, so, I was looking at what she was saying. She does not pack their lunches, which means that instead of doing breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and snacks I would assume or not um, every day she does the three meals only on the weekends and I don't know so I was like actually I'm I am making a bunch of meals uh, in during the day so I'm gonna tell you I made two four six seven Eleven. Eleven meals. Um, I had coffee with milk. I had two teas. I had uh, two servings of grapes. The kids both had two snacks today plus a fruit snack. So all of that food was covered in the $15.76 that I just mentioned. So there we go. If we stay on this track, we'll totally meet the goal of $500 this month for food. I'm feeling pretty happy about that because that was my goal was to get us under under $600 as our budget but to get us under $500. I have my whole system down. I'm gonna start blogging it. I'm probably not gonna do this conversation every single day. I might just give you totals. I'm not gonna go so into detail. I don't even know if I'm gonna do that but you saw my food all day long. Speaking of tea, that's how I'm finishing my day. So you saw my food all day long, but I am at the end of this vlog, which is coming in just a moment, going to put all of the meals that I fed the family. So enjoy. <laughs> 